News breaking news everyday news on Prince and Miller Entertainment TV. Today is the 6th of uh, April uh, 2022. How are you guys doing? Remember, guys, to like, share, comment, and follow, and turn on the notification bell so that you won't miss any of our new uploads that you do upload on this channel each and every day, each and every hour. And so, guys, uh, here's the latest news uh, Citizens are Coalition for Change, Triple C leader, Nelson Chamisa, has urged the parties at 20 legislators to focus on ensuring the amendment of the Electoral Act which will usher in sweeping reforms in the manner in which elections are conducted in Zimbabwe. The legislators who trumped in the March 26 by-elections were sworn in uh, Tuesday, which was yesterday. Triple C Deputy Spokesperson Ostalo Sibiza uh, said that Chamisa gave then a strong briefing shortly after their swearing in urging them to focus on leveling the electoral playing field ahead of next year's general elections. The president's message to our parliamentarians was centered on the reform agenda in preparation for the 2023 elections, which is important if Zimbabwe is to finally have free and fair and credible elections, Sibiza said. Other pointers were on the need for them to put citizens at the center of, of their every decision to lead with compassion, integrity and honesty and to craft laws for and on behalf of the ordinary people. Opposition Triple C bemoaned the unfair electoral field at last month's pause. In 2018, he claimed the Zimbabwe Electoral Commission ZEC was used to rig the election in favor of ZANU PF. And so I do agree with uh, what um, Chamisa said. Yes, my MPs have almost like a year to push for uh, that, you know a form of reforms. Uh, next year, my elections are, are free and fair. And uh, yes, I'm uh, going to make demonstrations. I'm going to push more. And uh, yes, uh, the amendment of the Electoral Act, uh, which will usher in sweeping reforms and in the manner in which elections are conducted in Zimbabwe. I still think that's the best uh, thing they can do. Uh, At the same time, they need to remember that uh, I promise on Rwanda during my campaigns and the need to uh, keep in mind that every decision that they make is on behalf of the people. And yeah. So guys, this is our daily news, breaking news, everyday news on Prince Miller Entertainment TV. Basaratangan us and yeah. so we hope uh, that, that they will deliver so that we can vote for them again uh, next year. And young way shanda in a season we could answer three way triple C three way NPF three way MDC Alliance. I young way I could teach one second mover the community forward and uh, yes a uh, basic service delivery and also my counselors again you guys you need to go back into the communities and when you want to farm by set to it basic service delivery to put it up one out to teaching it in your city otherwise uh next year change for terror one because you guys make a matter that could deliver and uh, so this is a daily news breaking news everyday news on prince and miller entertainment tv We're gonna keep you guys in the loop regarding to any new information uh, about our MPs and councillors and uh, could you uh, what I say my constituencies in my words are and uh, so thank you very much for listening and watching our daily news breaking news everyday news remember to like share comment and turn on the notification bell so that you won't miss any of our new uploads that we do upload here daily news breaking news everyday news bless up